Hi, this is Daniel Francis with Marine Max Orlando. Today I'm walking through this brand new and available 2023 Scout 240 Dorado. There is so much to go over with this boat, but I'll make it short and sweet. On the outside, we've got the full hole black, and this does have the midnight edition too, so you do have the powder coating um, options on the top and the, the handrails as well. You can see with the VHF. This does have the stainless steel rub rail with the black insert, as well as your integrated nav lights. You wouldn't be able to see that until you come check it out in person, but it's really nice to have there. Nothing sticking out, very flush. And then you've got this nice chrome print stripe here. This boat does have a magic tilt trailer underneath. You can option it with or without it, but it does look great the way it is. It also has the black 300 horsepower V8 Mercury here. Very quiet. You've got the captain's choice exhaust where you can make it really um, sporty or you can make it really quiet how it is. Then you see there's a very nice swim platform that you can actually walk across even with the motor up the way it is there. So we'll look underneath and this boat actually has the new Seakeeper ride system on it, which is awesome. When you're running, it will keep the boat from going side to side and up and down and makes it a really nice comfortable ride and it's basically an automatic trim tab system where you don't have to do anything and it'll make the ride do everything for you almost like your car would now so we'll go check out the inside of the boat there's a lot of options in here this is one of my favorite boats to show and they're really versatile transformable for fishing and the family so we'll go up here you'll see that there's a three-step ladder that fits right in you've got this sea decking on the back here that's really nice because you can actually, uh, it feels like you're wearing sandals without wearing sandals, but you go on the, the dock and off, you're not gonna slip or anything like that. And it feels really good on the feet. You've got a transom walkthrough door here that will close and lock. So if you have pets on the boat or if you're just offshore, wanna make sure no one can fall out, you have that. You've got a great seating layout here. This does have the bimini top. This will extend forward and you have a ton of shade but you have a very transformable stern area here. We'll start with this pull-out seat here, heavy duty, stainless steel, very comfortable. And the material of this boat is amazing. You feel the leather type, but it's marine grade. It'll hold up in the weather and it feels great and it looks even better. And then when you're stopping and you're ready to fish, you can put this back up. Now you have your leaning bolster here got rod holders across the back so if you're trolling and stuff you're good to go there you got a cup holder right there so if you need to put your drink down when you get that fish on you're ready to go you're not going to spill your drink and then on this side you do have a live well here and it is pressurized you got your rubber gasket around you also have your hoses here because you have a fresh water and raw water hookup and your hookups are actually back there on the transom as well yeah pull up cleats this boat is equipped with the uh, port side uh, fold out seat as well so you can pull this out you can pull this seat out here and then you can slide this seat back here and now you have a rear facing lounge a almost u-shaped couch here and you can just make this a really comfortable day Put your bimini up, have your lunch and your um, your dinner or your booze cruise, whatever you're doing here. Really nice. You've got your, um, you have your sink here with a cutting board and a nice place to put your utensils and knives and stuff there. Then right underneath, it's always great to have designated storage for a cooler so you don't have to be stepping over anything. It'll slide right out, open it up, get your drink, boom, got a nice Yeti. Your drink can be cold forever and it locks into place. That's a great option to have. And then just to finish up back here on the starboard side, you've got more rod holders. So if you aren't, um, if you aren't planning to fish to, on that day, you could still have your rods on the boat just in case you want to throw a line out. So we'll come to the midship area here. It, this boat just has so many options, but you have another cooler here. This one's built in, it'll drain overboard. And it's right under the seat. You wouldn't even be able to tell. You have your captain seats here and just the material. I mean, these things are nice, heavy duty. They spin around and you can actually turn this around like so. Pull your table up here. Boom, another place 
to have lunch or just enjoy drinks with your family. And then you can put this down, put it away, spin your seat around. Then everywhere you've got cup holders and handles as well. So we'll come to the bow of the boat here. You've got a nice walkthrough. This will actually close. You can open up this door here, close your, close your windshield here and really enclose the whole boat off from all the wind or if it were to rain if you're offshore fishing. It's really nice and you can actually take this windshield off as well too. So up here you actually have a ton of space, really comfortable rounded seats and you're deep down in there. I'm not tall but I'm not short but I'm deep in here and I feel comfortable and I can just imagine being offshore and having my kids up front and making sure that they're not sitting on the top, they're down in deep and uh, really have the peace of mind that everybody's safe no matter where you're at on the boat. You have a anchor locker up here, which will hold your anchor, won't be bouncing around. And then you also have these rod holder, cup holder combos here. So you can put your drink in there or you can put your, you can take up your rod, put your drink in there and reel in your fish. And it's just really nice to have those features there. You have storage underneath both seats. Come in and check that out. There's way too much storage to show in this video, but we'll come back towards the helm. You have a really nice head on this side. So it is a vacuum flush head. And then you also have the nice little teak um, flooring in there and a sink with a toilet paper holder as well. Really great option to have there. And then on the starboard side, you also have lockable storage. So if you want to take a shot in there, ton of storage in there, really great to have. And it's lockable. So if you want to put your valuables in there, if you're going on one of the getaways with us, then you can lock up all your valuables in there when you leave your boat in the water overnight. You have a battery charger here. All you have to do is just have a uh, extension cord, plug it right in, it'll charge all the batteries for you. So you're good, ready to go. And then last little storage space here, right in the middle of the boat, this will go right through so you can store anything that you want in there and it's nice and finished off. Here at the helm, you've got a flip up bolster. You put this down and you would think that you would have a little bit of visibility issues, but you can see right over just like you're driving a car. You've got a lockable glove compartment here, which is a great option to have. You also have a built-in uh, 12 inch Garmin. So it's all flush mounted. It looks really, really nice as well as the Mercury vessel view here. So you can toggle through all your engine options here. You actually have everything that you can see on your Mercury, on your Garmin. You have lights throughout the boat, your fusion stereo with the JL speakers and a really cool thing that makes it even more like a car. You have a remote, so you can actually turn on everything here. And if you just hold it down, you hear that button. You have your scout light right here. It tells you that the uh, car, I mean, the boat is on. And then you have uh, a lot of different things that you can do from this remote, which is really cool. So you could turn on all your lights, your courtesy lights, boom, they're blue, your nav lights, spreader lights, all the things that you can do from the Garmin you can do right here. So if you are at the restaurant and the sun's going down, you come out, you're like, boom, let me turn on the lights or let me put it in the nighttime mode or whatever you want to put it in. Your boat is going to be lit up and you're going to be like, whoa, you're going to be the bee's knees at the, uh, at the restaurant. And then last but not least, you can make this more comfortable by uh, being able to put the steering wheel up. You can flip up your bolster here. This will go forwards and backwards if you want to look under the windshield. But this is a quick look at the Scout 240 Dorado. My name is Daniel Frenchus with Marine Max Orlando. Give us a call, 407-590-0493.